Managed to get on the phone line, Doug Roxburgh, who, uh, I mean, you've also got a connection to Fort McMurray and area. You used to be a local TV producer here. How are you doing today? Doing very well. Love Fort McMurray and, and uh, you know, miss everybody up there. So I was reading a, an article, a CTV article, and I saw your name pop up because you're now Brand Integrity Director for Goodwill Alberta, and you had some stop by one of the shops in Sherwood Park that was absolutely astounding to me. That's correct. I've been working with Goodwill for the last six years. Uh, we have a mission of helping people with disabilities to find meaningful work through the resale of donated goods. And about a week ago in Sherwood Park at one of our Goodwill locations, one of our donation attendants came across a case. And inside the case was this immaculate black guitar fully autographed by every single member from Guns N' Roses. And it wasn't just they went out and got their autograph one time. They had followed the band around because there were specific dates on the guitar, and we had to get it verified to find out if it was real. Yeah, I saw it. There's different dates on there. So, I mean, some of, like one that I recognize right off the top, it said 2014, and I was trying to like figure out where were they in 2014, how close were they and everything. That's just crazy. So anonymous donor uh, drops these off, and then you had to get the verified. Worth, I'm sure, so much money to the organization. Yeah, we anticipate that it'll probably be between one and $3,000, Obviously, it depends on the collector. The funny thing is, is, as cool as this guitar was, it was actually brought in with a second guitar, and we weren't able to verify the names right away at the same time as we verified the Guns N' Roses names. It turns out, because a couple of the signatures were faded from the band, it was from Van Halen. Oh uh, but we just have to fully get that verified to, to make sure. <laughs> yeah, of course, yeah. I mean, crazy. Some collector out there parting with something. I, you, I'm so curious about the story. We may never know, but uh, awesome windfall for Goodwill. Yeah, and at the end of the day, as long as it's raising money for a mission, that's what we care about most. We get unique donations all the time. We've had everything from, you know, Sadly, a grenade to a narwhal tusk to a seal skin jacket. And we've seen autographs before. We've seen autographs from like the Oilers and, and, you know, famous players like that. But nothing like of an iconic, like, rock band that's internationally known. Like, we just haven't seen that come in before. Such a cool story. Well, uh, I hope that gets tons of money for you guys. And, of course, spreading the word of what you guys do using this opportunity. That's so awesome. Thanks for talking to me, Doug. Thanks a lot, Steve. And, and like I said, miss everybody up in 4Mac. 4Mac misses you too, man. Cheers.